The Light of Life Science team produces vaccines and biotherapeutics for global health, biodefense, and emerging infectious disease indications. Our primary customers are the National Institute of Health and the Department of Defense. We've been supporting the Malaria Vaccine Support Services contract out of uh, the National Institute of Allergies and Infectious Diseases uh, for about 13 years now. We work through a virtual pharma model where Lidos Life Science technical experts in manufacturing, process development, and regulatory affairs assembles a low-risk, technically expert drug development plan that is then executed through a team of national capabilities in contract manufacturing, research, biotechnology, and university science. We can take a product or a concept uh, from the stage of a sequence in silico way, uh, express that and take that all the way to a phase one clinical trial for the government to perform that phase one clinical trial. Um, and we do that because we have top-notch scientists from around the nation um, and really from around the globe. They come from industry, academia, former government employees in important places like the FDA and biotechnology companies. Our successes have been really uh, important to us and our customer. Uh, we have just completed manufacture of our fourth malaria vaccine for use in clinical trials and we have provided other candidate vaccines in that program to support four other clinical trials in the past. We can provide direction on strategy as far as regulatory strategy, um, meetings with the FDA, compliance, making sure that the company is meeting either good manufacturing practices, good laboratory practices, good clinical practices, putting together compliance submissions for the FDA. We can also go ahead and write and create all of the documents that are needed for the application. The benefits of our approach allow our customers only to use facilities and resources as they're needed. Uh, we don't have a requirement for maintaining facilities, which can be very expensive uh, and, and labor intensive. Uh, it also provides the customer the ability to use uh, very rare technical resources only as needed, and as well as have access to facilities and technologies around the country or even around the world uh, that they wouldn't be able to get either timely or have reliable access to. The reason I think that the, the virtual pharmaceutical model really works is because we're not beholden to any one single piece of technology or, or partner that we have to deal with. At any moment we can bring in the right tool, the right partner, the right solution basically where we go out and we seek that. Our guys are always out there looking for the next best uh, tool, the next best technology. In some cases, it's a pharmaceutical partner. In some cases, it's an academic partner. But most of the time, it's a biotech who's brought in a new piece of technology. Um, and then we can just plug that right into our, our program. The work that we do is very important. Our, our mission is in global health, biodefense, and emerging infectious diseases. Our staff are very dedicated. They take our customers' work very seriously and take pride in being able to make accomplishments in drug and vaccine development related to these global health and national security problems.